we're back with another STO Star Trek Online. Fellow captains, greetings. Jody Ram Life here. We're doing a, a TFO. We're down upon, a, I don't know what planet this is. Stardate 0201020, 21st century. As we find ourselves trying to stay alive. <laughs> but we're advancing as the story progresses through Jody's life. Two characters being created. Uh, here, let me grab some water. We'll be right back. Forgive me. I needed that. Gotta start coming to the wharf is prepared. So uh, it's going to be a casual. It's going to be a casual run through on this episode. Part one of two. But uh, what are your thoughts? What are your feelings, guys? Uh, it's a 10, uh, this game has been out for 10 years, to my understanding. I see some advancements. The heralds are activating a new set of devices. Proceed to that location. Alrighty then. Where's my team? So yeah, I mean, uh, similar to, you know, WoW, this game's been out there as long. I think they've been uh, creating some good content for the diehard fans. Shout out to the Trekkieverse. I enjoy it just as much as, you know, the Star Wars universe. Shoot, I'm a collector of uh, comics myself. Little back backstory about me can't act the devices like that. are resetting synchronize and try again ah. initiate shutdowns at the same time this is crazy <laughs> I'm really just trying to do what I can to, to help my team those Iconian uh, rifles are just tearing me apart ripping through my shields. So what have you guys been thinking about uh, Season 1? The chapters of Jody Ramlife. To, to, uh, to come, uh, we got part of the Federation. Uh, tough Swallow Pill. And then uh, Tough Tough Beer Bawas. She's a Klingon woman. Wanted to be a part of the KDF before I get these uh, Federation uh, expansions for Star Trek. Drop a little bit into the coin. I appreciate the lore of uh, Star Trek. I'm glad they brought that, that realism to it. Got to pull out my sword. They're getting in close, aren't they? <laughs> So I, like I said, I don't know exactly what I'm doing in this dungeon. I'm just following my teammates. As you see, I got some of them flying around. I'm just doing what I can to help them out. <laughs> my drone's still not operational. Ain't give him a little shield. <laughs> Where did that thing come from? Set up a little turret out here. You have 15 seconds. Disable the other two Iconian devices. Ah, 15 seconds, where is it at? 
I would assume it's over there in that cluster, uh, that gaggle. Yeah, we're gonna monetize ourselves. There's a lot about me, you know, I'm in my, uh, I'm in my 30s. I got children myself. Oh, shoot, I even got a cuss jar. Uh, I'm gonna be able, I'm gonna be able to pay our way to Disney World the way, the way that I talk. We're getting better, especially with this content creation. Like, sub, you know, especially uh, what I favor is leave your comments, you know, so I can always get better at what I do. Right where they popped out. <laughs> Let's get behind some cover, right? The devices are resetting. Synchronize and try again. Initiate some Ooh, downs in the city. It's hectic out here. Ah. I didn't want to set that up right there behind that wall. Oopsies. Whoever's turret this is, it's doing some damage. It has that same Iconium beam. Has to be unlocked from that. Guarantee it. About a minute. You have 15 seconds to disable the other Said a minute. 50 seconds to be honest. Onward, men. So this is very interesting. This is my first time in this uh, this dungeon. Glad we got a good tank. I'm just DPS at this point. As an engineer should be. I don't think I'm drawing that much aggro. So anybody that doesn't know about, you know, MMORPGs or RPGs in general, aggro, bringing attention to yourself, uh, was that, uh, boys, it's like on the tip of my tongue. I'll, I'll remember it later. But yeah, DPS, uh, damage per second. So uh, I, I like to think that I'm helping. Yeah, mission accomplished. Nice, nice. There's no abnormalities. Uh, I want some Iconian stuff because that's what they're shooting, right? We're gonna hope for the best. Fleet smart, too. You guys do good with that. I'm in a fleet. Six Fleet. Shout out to Six Fleet. STO, Star Trek Online. particular moment. Loading up Deep Space Nine. So like I said in uh, the beginning of videos, as you guys been trekking my story, down here at Deep Space Nine, I've finally been getting the acclamations of the game and uh, getting myself leveled up accordingly. So I can hang in there with the big boys. Well, things are looking good. Things are looking bright. Uh, in the words of myself, in respect to the great Leonard Nimoy, you know, uh, stay blessed and stay prosperous. That's the new channel's outro. Trademark copy by Jody Gaming. <laughs> My boy says we can't uh, trademark a phrase. I think he's wrong, so uh, we're going to see about that. As we get underway. <laughs> so um, I'm a bit cluttered at the moment. Man, you always see some crazy things happening. At uh, I swear I know how to speak correctly. Deep Space Nine. 
but like I was saying, I'm a bit cluttered at the moment. I wanted to get your guys' uh, take on uh, STO. Is it dead? Is it not? I don't believe it is. And especially with the free to play. I'm really enjoying that. And if you care to get extra skins away, you can dabble into the Z Bucks. Kind of like, it's just like a Fortnite, just like any other uh, pay to play. But it's not, it's free. Come check it out. So, um, I'm going to fast forward through some clips. And like I said, we're a bit bogged down with inventory. I was getting uh, acclimated. I was getting uh, situated at the house as well. And uh, we got that taken care of through this uh, rendition. Like I said, this is part one of two. Second part uh, I'm going to bring to you uh, our mission that we're going to bring up. So we've been going through the missions and leveling up. Everybody's glowing here at Deep Space Nine. Can't recall recall what the mission was. Man, what happened there? Uh, like I was saying, um, <laughs> I can't recall what the mission was that uh, is coming up. But we need to clear our inventory. That is our goal. Uh, bring the comments uh, like uh, like a discussion, uh, especially at my Discord. I'm getting that all squared away. Uh, you can find that at uh, Jody Jody's Gaming on Discord. Tell me your thoughts. Are we dead? Are we alive? Are we afloat? I think we're very much afloat. Especially a community of uh, 3,000 strong, die-hard Trekkie fans, man. Uh, Martha. So that's going to be her new name. Like I said, we got, I got two different voices coming out. One's a Ferengi. One's a Klingon woman. Martha. That's our specialist. Like I said, I've been dabbling in the Z store. This is like uh, some post-production uh, scenes we have going on here. There's been some Phoenix Prize trophies. Uh, we're now rounding in a 20 and 21st century, 2021. February. Happy New Year, y'all. New Year, new tune. So I'd like to bring to y'all. So, like, as you saw, I was really bogged down. Here's my bank. I've opened up some new things. Got some new slots. So I'm going to skim through this. Let's get to it. Let's move some things around. Casual as casual can do. Otherwise, this would have took forever. You guys don't want to see that. like to bring to you the action here at Jody Gaming. Especially when it comes to gaming. That's where we're about. Gaming, right? Got a whole new schedule, whole new year, projects underway. It's all it's all unraveling. Like a big gift. <laughs> Got some lag there. So I like to bring it in here into the bar, talk to Cork. He's my main man. He's who I sell to. It doesn't make a difference who you sell to. So that's my new ship I, we just unlocked. We're off the cruiser. We're now in uh, Temporal Ops. So I wanted uh, to get that because uh, Viral actually I've upgraded into a Temporal Operative. So here's some stats looking at the USS Viking now. No longer in the Bonanza y'all. Here's our crew. We've uh, we saved decks coming up in a later chapter, new chapter. It's crazy out here in Deep Space Nine. You know, getting back to the lore too. Uh, you can check me on. Uh, I say this all the time, not to inflate myself, but shoot, just to promote it. 
you know, in promoting this game as well. Uh, Star Trek, the Picard, the new uh, episodes, Romulan Refugee. Now you can't see me right now, but I'm pointing at myself. <laughs> GG. But you know, I'm trying to get into the Actors Guild. So it's something that I do. As well as a plethora of other things. So we're getting all the skill traits. Burrow my temporal operative. Tovin's still with us. New science officer on deck. She's sisters to uh, forget her name. Forget their names. Her name's like Mama. Kowal Mama. A Romulan. Let's skip through this real quick. So it's just getting all our uh, our manuals that I've uh, purchased and paid for underway. Like I said, you guys don't want to sit through all that. The technicalities of it all. Cork. <laughs> hey! They're glowing. Like I said, all the crazy things you can see on Deep Space Nine. I can do that too. Kind of, sort of. Ha, <laughs> GG, y'all. <laughs> Let's get it. Fast forward through that, get to the bank, move some things around. Like I said, it was a lot. I was bogged down crazy. So now we're just uh, customizing so we know where everything's at. And what I like to do when it comes to my inventory, I like to set disposables. Especially uh, for rare, legendary, and epic items, you know, up at the top and stuff, so I can recycle, reuse, know what I need. Uh, that's my farming, farming loadout. You say that's my farming loadout. Tip and trick. Aha, part one of two, right? <laughs> Jody Ram Life <laughs> out here at STO. But yeah, you gotta do that in RPGs, you gotta farm. We're looking spiffy, Martha, Steffi, Tovin, Verl. All right. Stations are good to go. I believe the away team's good to go too. So again, part one of two, you know, uh, leave in the commentary dislikes, likes, you know, pros and cons of the game. Are we a are we dead? Are we afloat? You know, on on sea terminology. Was it were uh, international waters? <laughs> Whoa! What is this guy? This guy's trippy. GG. Deep Space Nine. Uh, I think Steffi was. Uh, I wanted to make her taller. Progress completed that. Uh, another little insight about the channel. I gotta go grab my glasses for the next part because there will be some reading, but I'm gonna improv and skip through it. I can't get it verbatim. Like, if you go look, look back at the Breen Invasion uh, tip and trick video that I have. I was trying to get it verbatim, but it's not its not going to be possible. The words are too small. I'm getting too old for this. In the words of Danny Glover. <laughs> uh, what is this? Reputation, assignment set complete. Still got to go. And like I said, uh, my bridge officer, Steffi, I think she's too short. I want to make her taller. Before we get underway on part two. Wondering about the music in the background, that's a shout out to Stream Beats. If you haven't got it by now, get it. If you're not on any other streaming platform, you know, no copyright infringement brought to you by uh, Alpha Gaming. Shout out to them too. He, uh, he really knows what he's doing. And I'm just trying to make, I'm trying to make quality over quantity when it comes to this channel. I'd really like to know your insight. 
and again how we can get better been saying what I can't uh, I should be doing I should be doing it all doesn't doesn't matter whether uh, I like it or not got to get out that comfort zone that's where that magic happens law of attraction and especially letting you guys know a little bit more about myself uh, that's the alpha quadrant shields doo -doo -doo -doo, body armors that's not that's not utility armor versus it's not where it's at. We're all good to go on that aspect. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Now I really like Deep Space Nine because uh, it has everything just you know congregated together, and so you can really uh, get to everything: repairing your ships, managing your ships, duty officers. Go uh, take the elevator, the turbo lift up to the ops deck all right at your fingertips so I'm gonna get to the tailor that's who I was looking for I'm gonna grab my glasses this takes a bit of time before I let you know on the mission we're gonna head out to so these are our outfits that we have initially we're on a whole new level now but I wanted to get the steppy we just gave her some hair but she's still an alien species, and I think she's just a bit small. She's like, I think she's standing at like 5'7 right now. I want to make her like 5'9. Been notating in my head of what I want to say in a dialogue, another uh, post production tidbit. Before I chug down this water, go on pause. Trust me, you guys won't even know. <laughs> So I'm loving what we, we, we got going on. And you know, it's just more to come. Casual listening to. Yeah, there we go, the body. Put me back to the body. Maybe on later, I want to unlock some of these uniforms. And she has some sexy ones. <laughs> that's why I created a Klingon female as well for one of my other tunes just tired of looking at a guy catch us on GTA not really supposed to be talking about other games but I play a plethora of them I'm a gamer at heart Shoot, I got old school Super Nintendos and uh, 64's I got signature series comic books on the wall can't wait to get our cam. We're getting our green screen next month. Everything's looking brighter. So we're going to save those changes. I like that height. Like I said, it's a, it's a long wait to get. I like to do all this off screen so you guys don't have to, you guys don't have to be here for it. Like I said, this is part one of part two. And part two is going to include the mission that we're about to undertake. And this is why I said I'm going to need my glasses. Let's roll our lucky ball. Always blessings here on Jody Gaming. On Deep Space Nine. And we're going to take part in the Coliseum. So that's going to be the mission that we're going to go to as we transwarp. Let's get it. We're back. Begin the Coliseum with another STO. Jody Ram Life. All my diehards know this is part two. We're getting in to the Coliseum. Let's see what this mission's about. Like I said, fluently. Come on, load screen.
Do, 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 do. No pada system. Admiral, I'm not reading any activity at the vessel on sensors. Roger that. Let's get closer. Let's get this R&D real quick. Real easy. Up, up, down, and left, right sequencing. What do you guys think of the Viking? Just upgraded our ship on STO. Yeah, I went to the Zen store, but I had to do it. I needed a temporal slot. Admiral, I'm detecting energy readings from the satellite. What the? Scan the satellite. What is this, a tractor beam? I can't break out, can't do nothing. Admiral, be, uh, we're stuck. It's been uh, beaming holding like this and continue. The chief says that we have enough power uh, for backup transport. Okay, well, we got transport over there. We're ready to beam over. Beam over to the satellite. This is the new bridge officer squad. Marta, Verl, Steffi, Tovin, and of course Captain Jody. Looking spiffy out here. Star Trek Online. Like I said, I'm not going to be stressing myself on the wordage or what have you not to get through these uh, missions. The Coliseum. So I'm going to be doing some improvisation. Welcome to Jody Gaming. Mysterious Satellite. Captain, the consoles here appear to be in control of the draining of the power. Okay, well these consoles are draining the power to my ship. So I'm going to need to deactivate these. Access satellite operations. Loading. Okay, well that did absolutely nothing. What did that do? Can't do anything. Preposterous. What's this up here? Some more R&D back there. This console doesn't appear to be locked like the others. Okay. Whatever it did must not have enough. I see that the problem in the Ramian consoles are uh, consoling a lockout forcing and, and satellite permit through the Okay, sequencing. Sequencing code. It seems like I gotta get the numbers in the right order where they're missing. Okay. We'll start with the cycle left, lock in position, cycle right. Okay, well, that obviously didn't do anything. Start with the first number. 12, 1232, 1144. I don't I don't see the I don't see a pattern here. When in doubt, see out, right? <laughs> That's a whole different line. Uh, we're going to do guess and check. So, lock in position. Cycle right. Turned it to seven. I think that's good to go. Green, right? See, that's yellow. Let's go back to right. Okay, that's green now, too. See, that's yellow. See, that's still yellow. We'll keep going right, since that's the way we started. 
See, there's boom. Wow, okay. Guess and check. When in doubt, see out. <laughs> I'm gonna get that. I'm gonna get that branded too. While we're talking about it. <laughs> Uh, same thing. There we go. Do 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 do. Ooh, this is tedious. You guys, don't mind if I put on some background music, right? Appreciate the background music too. There you go, two greens. Part two, the mysterious satellite. Mission of the Coliseum. Good lord. There we go. Oh, there we go. Captain, uh, we have achieved the equation that was occurring in the other consoles, blah, 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 blah. Let me get this R&D. God, that took forever. Unlock the satellite uh, control consoles. There's three of them. Unlock the satellite operations console. Operations, targeting, and uh, generator? Long range targeting override. Long distance scanners. Okay, well that's done. Awesome. Captain, this console is a satellite's targeting functions. I'm not sure if there's a way to disable whenever. Oh, there's always a way to disable. Especially being an engineer class. Captain Jody's on hand. So access to targeting, see it's targeting the, uh, the Viking, set as priority, return to main menu, expand, expand, we're going to shrink in, shrink in the radius sounds like a good idea. Open ship. Aha. Recently deflected the Hulk. Active right now. Examine. Tell my thermic daddy. There we go. Admiral, the satellite has uh, ensured a piece of... Okay, as long as we got got the oh, ship away. Good stuff. Alright. Making progress. I told you, Tovin. There's always a way to deactivate something. Especially being an engineer. It's a cool class. <clears throat> I like the functionality. My other two tunes are uh, combat, and I can't wait to create my science when I uh, unlock the Jem'Hadar uh, Vanguard faction. This console is a satellite's power supply. Well, that sounds like something I want to deactivate. Since we're here, update power save modes, set process priority values. Uh, doo -doo -doo -doo. Load power saver mode normal. Load power save mode economical. Economical. See, that's why I said uh, post production 
little tad, <laughs> a little little note. <laughs> Why I needed my glasses. <laughs> oh, I can't wait to get this camera. It's gonna be fabuloso. Admiral, we found out that the Viking does not attempt to moor to fire the satellite that is willing to encourage low power of the vessel. Okay. One more console to go, guys. Bear with me. I know it's a long reel, but it's a long game. I love uh, I love the new expansions that they have uh, for the chronological history of Star Trek Online. This console controls satellites. Uh, okay, change satellite state. Uh, state off. Yeah, I want this thing off. It's too off. Thank you. End session. Captain Sissons are coming back online. All over the ship. Thank you, Mama. Mama and Martha. Might have to keep her. And just buy some more bridge officer slots. She's just weird looking. <laughs> but she's good in space combat. Give her that. If you guys haven't been around to it, check out my other channel, Jody AFK. Again, a lot of a lot of post production stuff is going to be up on there. What the? Where am I? No, seriously, where are we? Oh, this is a trip. Now what? If you fail to comply with now we fight or we die. Who are I you? Pick up a melee weapon. All of your gear is deactivated, and I won't protect you in there. Shoot, it doesn't look like you can protect yourself. We're gonna need some luck on our side. Star Trek Unlike. <laughs> Unlike. <laughs> like, 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 online. Let's get this R&D real quick. Jody's life. I don't know where we are. We've got to pick up a melee weapon. Prisoner just run. Ooh, a Klingon uh, Bathra, and it's green. I think that's a good enough melee weapon, even though we got our sword. It says I gotta go this way. Prisoner 1478. I gotta get a weapon from here too. I mean, we could be double strapped. Was with the functionalities. Pick up a blah blah. We already got a blah blah, and we got a sword. I think uh, the Lepre. Lepre. <laughs> Leave in the comments uh, how you say uh, it's a Falcon weapon. So that's what they use on Falcon. Or I think they use a sword. And Romulans use it. No, Falcons use a, a Lepri. Lepria. Yeah, bro, I got a sword. Can I not use my sword? Yeah, we're definitely equipped in that. For honor! Gotta get rid of my phaser, I would assume. Oh, well, then we should be good to go. So, what's up? What's up, prisoner? Is this the way to go? Yes, the way to go. Get our Blothra. Green's way better than any common equipment. Testing area. You guys see that sword across the field? Enemy targets on sensors. Yeah, there's spiders. Yeah, you go handle that prisoner. I'll help you a little bit. Teamwork. Teamwork makes a dream work. Best strategy. Ooh, 
Ooh. Releasing Warrigals now. Oh, yikes. Let me see if I can pick up this sword while I'm here. Before the Warrigals get my boy. And I cannot. Hey, get off the homie. Ah, uh, take that. Take that. Die. At least they're not doing that much damage. Proceeding. I don't know how he's doing. Yes. Oh, that was that little pet I wanted. Over there on Deep Space Nine, he sells them on the the top floor. Tip a trick. <laughs> Dang, you're not even going to help, prisoner. Thought we were friends. Ooh. Yeah, flanking. Nice, nice. Ooh. Leave you. Yikes. You're fine. All right, bro, bro. Damn, they're talking about punishments. Got the homie on lock. Where are we? Another captain's log. Jody's life. Jody Ram life. Yeah, so we're going to have to uncover where we're at. But tune in next time. And like always, on Jody Gaming, stay blessed, stay prosperous. Yeah, I'm going to need some more luck while we're here. Yes, let's get it.